will be nice. It's fine, thank you. How long have you been here? Not quite. Uh, let's say uh, 25 minutes ago. 25 minutes? And no one is here already. My God. They said the lecture was supposed to start around 9 a.m. And it's past 10 already. You see, maybe the information we got was wrong. As you can see, our cost rep is yet to arrive. Okay. I see. Let's sit and wait for them there. Yeah, sure. <laughs> You slept well? Yes, I did. <laughs> These people went. They're funny. You'll just change them without letting them know. Juliet, I am really, really sorry that I couldn't finish what you asked me to do. Do you know, I was rushing for lectures. You can do lecture and code by 9 a.m. when it was shifted to 11. Then you were in class yesterday. It was announced by the class right? Are you serious? I didn't get that. I left after Mr. Chikino's lectures yesterday. Did you see anyone inside the class? Inside the class, when I came to home. No, it was only a bin I saw outside. And then we had to sit there together and wait for everyone to come. That was not right. You must be hungry, I guess. I am home. What are you thinking? We'll go to the tribulation. Definitely. Look at you. I trust you. You come to school with money. Let's go. I'll pay. <laughs> It's, it's, it's stressful telling you, okay, you should be happy that we just have seven months to leave this school. The last time I went to my mom was complaining a bit. Now what kept you? You can't know what's in the office when I talked. So you finally saw him, right? Let's go, let's go, let's go. Um, hi, Frank. Hey. Can I see for a minute, please? What are you doing in the midst of those guys? What, what am I doing in this? I don't understand the question. You don't understand my question? I have told you I don't like their company. I'm suspecting them. Us. As cultists. And I've told you to stop moving with them, but you wouldn't listen. Wait. Why do you even hate yourself for nothing? Huh? Wait. You suspect my friends of being cultists, right? That means you also suspect me, right? I swear, I don't like the way you reason sometimes. I swear. Really? Yeah. So now I reason foolishly, right? I know. I don't even like twisting my words. I mean, we are talking about this one, you're twisting my words again. It's, it's unfair the way... You know what, Frank? Thank you. It's either you choose me or you choose them. Oh, my God. Look at that man shining his eyes like a criminal. Get you a better company, Frank. You should choose. Angel! Angel! Angel, why, why, why are you walking out on me now? Babes, I'm exhausted. I feel the same too, dear. Oh. <clears throat> Hello? Who is this? Oh, Derek. I'm fine. And you? Oh, 
I'm so sorry, I'm not around. I travel to see a sick friend. Oh, don't worry, I will let you know once I get back, okay? Alright, bye. So, who was that? A dying toaster. You shouldn't have lied. <laughs> what would I have told him? The truth. Good Samaritan. That I was around. So he'd come disturbing. Okay, so did you tell this dying toaster that you have a guy? Of course I did. And? You know these guys now, how disturbing and persistent they can be. Mirabel, men can be very stubborn especially when they see who they love. I think this strange toaster is really in love with you. <laughs> ha. Most of this love is fake now. All they want to do is just to browse the internet and exhaust the data. <laughs> so, which network are you? <laughs> Please. You're crazy! <laughs> Sorry, I'm so sorry. Uh, please, why are you why are you doing this to me? Because you're very stubborn. I told you I was not comfortable with these guys. They look trampish. Those guys are harmless. Yes, they're my friends. Okay, tell me, how do you expect us to start avoiding them? How? Are they the only friends you have, friend? What about Akene? I mean, he's better than Charles and Chidi. Why? Why? Because he's wise, he's intelligent, like he's more focused than those miscrimes. No, 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 babe, please. I wouldn't take exception to you calling him that. No, they're my friends. We sh shouldn't be saying, why would you call me? Frank, you know, we should have ended this argument a long time ago when I told you to choose between me and them. And I am telling you again, choose them and leave me alone. Baby, don't go there. Baby, please. Stop this. What's your name? My name is Chinere. Wow. Nice meeting you. Okay. Same here. Yeah. And thank you. Thanks, thanks again. It's all right. Parents have not come to visit me all this while. Have you considered their own program? What program are you talking about? What program will prevent them from coming to visit their daughter, especially now that we are rounding off? Babe, there is no point bothering yourself by your parents not visiting you. Why? Because they gave you what you want. Food, clothes, money. Everything! Despite all that, Mirabel, I really miss them. 
you should go back to your mother's home. Shut up, Joe. Naughty girl. <laughs> Let me take that as a compliment. How you boy? Yeah, good afternoon. Are you serious? Ah, baby, you're sharp. <laughs> sharp. Madam, please, do you have egg? How did that? Mama, <laughs> you are money. You are money. Look at how serious you were. Hmm? What will I do now? Eh? Obina, Ma. you are looking too good, though. Ah. Eh? Mama, like this. With all the stress of school. You are still looking good. Every time you be complaining of stress. Thank you, Mama. Thank you. Hmm? You know, when I graduate, I will look even better, you know? Mm. <laughs> and you will take care of me. Of course. Who else will eat my money? <laughs> hey! Uh, where are you? Yeah. Hey! You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you, Mama. Uh, what of uh, your brother, Ken? Ah, Ken is fine. Ken is fine. Uh, Everything is fine. So, Mama, do you have boiled eggs? Obina, don't try me this time. The last time you came, I shot five eggs out of three crates. Let me go and boil eggs. Does it matter? It's my mother's egg. Hey! Bye bye here. Hello. Oh, good afternoon. Please, I want to buy pig milk. Bros, I say I won't buy pig milk. I be not be you they sell market for you. Sorry, um, what do you say you want? Please give me pig milk. Okay, pick me up, right? You. Oops, um, please, um, sorry. I am Obina, but you can call me Beans. So, what's yours? Okay, Uncle Beans. I don't tell strangers my name. Oh, come on. <laughs> you called me stranger. Yet you mentioned my name, Beans. Tell me, come on, tell me. What's your name? Um, have we met before? Your face looks familiar. Um, not really, but I have been seeing you around village. Really? <laughs> okay. I, my name is Destiny, and I... I stay around. Destiny. Mm. Yes. That's good, but one thing. One more thing, I want to have your digits, so... It's not necessary, Uncle Beans. Thank you. I won't buy matches. Guy, I won't buy matches. I won't buy matches! So, 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 sorry. What did you say you want to buy? Matches? Uh, no, I don't want to buy matches. I want to buy Otoropa. Itako. Bring matches, Joe!
Yo, Ken! <laughs> My man, you're back. What's up, yeah? I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. So, how are you on school? Good, we're digging it. Mmm, yeah. I see. So, how is my man there with you? Yeah, fine. Oh. Mom sent something for you. Seriously? What's that? Something very small. <laughs> what? She gave you this for me? Yes. Huh? Thank you, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> What can I say more? Nothing. Don't say anything. We are brothers. Yeah, we are brothers. We are brothers for life. <laughs> <laughs> thank See, you, um, thank you. Ken. Mom promised to do everything within her power mm. to make sure this cross is passed away. Okay? No problem. No problem. I have a gist for you. Yeah. What happened? I met a girl, a pretty girl. Wow. Where? <laughs> That's always coming by. <laughs> so tell me, tell me about this girl. Okay, sit down, <laughs> sit down. <laughs> sit down, sit, 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 sit. sit. <laughs> this man will not kill somebody with research, honestly. Hello? What? How? Where? When? What? Who was that? My mother. My mother. She had an accident. Oh my god! I should be my mother. Look, ma. doing this? Why are you avoiding lectures now that you're in your final year? And who told you that? I can have told me. And that was because I was at your faculty yesterday. What is going on? Are you going to deny it? Listen, nothing is going on. And you should stop monitoring me. Is that the bad I've done? Frank? Stop it. It's okay. No worries. I'll let you go. What is, what is your problem, Seth? Every time you're monitoring someone. Come on, John. Which can I clean? How was your journey? She's fine. Yesterday she was discharged from the hospital. No, I tried calling you, but to no avail. That's because my phone was snatched away from me. Sorry about that. It's okay, dear. You know, it was just like a nightmare. Before I knew it, this strange guy came out from nowhere. Boom! Snatched my bag from me and immediately he zoomed off. Do you know I've had that experience at Apple Junction? Apple Junction? Yes! That's exactly where this incident I'm telling you happened. I mean, that place is terrible. Oh, I, I didn't know. You can say that again. Mm -hmm. okay. It's okay, dear. I'll get a new phone tomorrow. No big deal. So, how is school? Any quiz, any assignment, anything? Yeah, we wrote our muddy first quiz <gasps> yesterday. What? I wrote for you. <sighs> Mirabel, mm -hmm. you are a darling. How can I miss that man's face? Mm. That means carry over for me. No, no. Give me five. Not when I'm still here. What are friends for? So, what about um, attendance? I wrote everything. Ah, I wrote a, a quiz. It's not attendance. It's attendance. I cannot write. I love you too. <laughs> Our friends for now. Anything. I'm a friend's 
something go to the kitchen just you <laughs> that's silly baby But I'm sorry. Do you know Juliet? Stay away from her. That girl is my girl. Did you get me? What's the meaning of that? You will understand the meaning of that. The next time I get you one inch close to her, I will melt you into pieces. Do you know the reason why I'm telling you that? Okay, what are we going on? I can't get like I'm going here again. I'm going here go for those. You get me? Now, March. Hmm? March. Understand the point here. How could you be dating a cultist and you claim to love me? Please do it. You should know better. Oh. Don't, I told that idiot not to disturb me again. He's been disturbing me. Did you tell me? Did you tell me? Of course, you enjoy every bit of his disturbance. I'm sorry for me. I thought I could handle the situation myself. You could handle the situation yourself. You, Juliet, handle the situation yourself. He want me to stay off you. See, I don't want to risk my life for this. Please, I'm sorry. Where are you going to? Please. Goodbye. I love you.
You don't look okay. What is wrong with you? Seems I'm having fever. When did it start? This morning. You should have come to tell me. Go to a chemist's chemist. Tell him exactly what is happening to you. He will know what to do. Huh? Thank you, Mama. <clears throat> Have you had something to eat this morning? Mm. Since morning. If you get the medication, the door is open. Make sure you eat before you take it. Thank you, Mama. Thank you. And next time you're feeling that way, make sure you tell me. So you have the boldness to tell me that that Jew man, that local man, that good for nothing scavenger is your boyfriend. <laughs> if you are looking for someone who is a scavenger, you are the one. I've told you I cannot date a cultics. Do you understand that? You slap me. Let me hear you repeat such nonsense, such rubbish with me. Are you insane? Are you mad? Let me get it clear to you. As long as you are in this school, <laughs> if I don't have you, no one else will. <laughs> no one else. Me, aka Spices, Crystal Clear Man, <laughs> aka Grandma. So sick. I know. I know that I'm sick. That is why I want to have you, by all means. I know that. But let me get to you. The next time I'm going to get you, I'm a fuck your ass, baby. Ah, uh -uh. Ken, what? you're still reading. Man, you know this is injury time, so I need to read. Oh yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Ken, guess what? What? Guess where it's on campus today. You remember the girl I always told you about? The girl you told me about? Uh, the girl I told you about! <laughs> yes, 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 yes. What happened? She is on campus with us. For real? Yes. That's good. That's good. Man, I can't wait to see this girl that is making you go crazy. Sure you will. So, I will bring her. Hmm? Is that right? Is, that is right? there anything in the kitchen? Yes, I have something. Boy. <laughs> Please have me keep this. Let me check it out. All right, man. Oh, my goodness. That's good, that's good. Mama? Hey! Ah. <laughs> Mama? Hey! Oh, my children. Hmm? Come, come, come. My children. What? I know you're surprised. I know. I don't like this type of surprise now. Eh? <laughs> good afternoon. Afternoon. <laughs> Eh? At least you tell me you are coming, so I prepare something special. Uh, but we are here. Uh, we are here. Oh, it's okay. We are here. Uh, <laughs> we are here. Uh, okay. I was busy in the kitchen before you arrived. Let's go and smoke that smoke together. Uh, no now problem. that let's you are go. here. It's okay. Uh, uh, okay, okay. Let's go. Uh, <laughs>
Children, you are not looking bad. How is school? School is fine, school is fine <laughs> Just this big head giving me issues. Uh, <laughs> see, very soon, two of you will start getting pot belly. Ah. You are really enjoying my food stuffs in school. Uh, mama, you are trying. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> thank you, Mama. Thank you. Hey. So, Mama, how is um, business? I'm trying my best. I know. At least for you people, I'll keep trying my best. <laughs> Thank you, Baba. I'll keep trying my best. Eh? Coming without telling me. You should go inside now. Let me finish cooking and dish food. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, Mama, have you seen Uju? Ah! Oh, Uju left this morning, though. Really? Mm. Do you know this girl took it without telling me? But she has fully recovered. Uh, mm, she's very, very okay now. Okay. Mm. Did she tell you? No. She didn't. Must she tell you? She told me. Oh, I go inside then. Let me dish food and bring to you. Uh, I said you want to Let me go and pour water. Hey. My money. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yay! Yeah. Obina. You are the only child in this family. Oh, no. Very soon you will be graduating from school. Mm. You need a woman to fill this family. Um, Mom, I feel Uju will make a good wife. Which Uju are you talking about? The Uju you know now, Ken's sister. <laughs> what are you laughing? <sighs> okay, Mama. I have heard you. And I am already walking towards that. Really? Yes. But definitely not Uju. Who then? You see, Mama, there is this um, there is this girl that came to buy something from our shop the last time I returned. Okay. She's the one. She's the one I want to marry. Do I know her? You may not know her, but she's in the same school with me and also from this community. Okay. Mama, she's light-skinned and beautiful. You would like her. Uju is also beautiful and has good manners. Everything you need in a woman. I know. Uh huh. But Uju is my blood. Huh? I, 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 I see her as my very younger sister. So what will I be doing with her? But Uju is not your sister. A lot of things. There are lots of things you can do with Uju. Why are you asking me that question? A lot of things. Huh? Do you have eyes at all? To see good things when you see it. Oh, Mama. I'll bring the girl for you to see. Is that girl in my shop? Fair.
Why didn't you show up yesterday at the party after my invitation? Because I was not chanced. Love, tell me what I want to know. Are you avoiding me? You're hurting me! I told you I was busy. Spare me that trash. Oh, oh sorry. sorry. How could you turn down my offer? My invitation? How could you do that? I missed you at the party, baby. Do not fuck with me. I'm letting you go because I love you. See you soon, love. See you soon. That guy is a ton of my flesh. He has refused to let me. He now monitors me like an evil spirit. My boyfriend is running away from me because of that bastard. Babe, that's the problem with these cultists. Once they see you, you're finished. Cynthia, I'm losing my, my, my guy because of him. He doesn't want to let me be. He has refused to listen to me. I told him I have a guy and I love him too. He didn't expect him to listen to me when he has seen what he wanted. See, let me tell you something. It's very difficult for his eyes to open. He has to get his eyes off me. I don't want him. All I want is a do. I do, I do. I'm confused. It's okay. Thank you, children. Tell me that extra school fees, extra exams, mm -hmm. and God forbid, a suit. <laughs> I am very I'm glad you know that. <laughs> I do. Yeah. So. I was in that dream and you shot someone. Then the police came and arrested you. From there they took you to the prison. Why? You shot someone? Yes. You know you don't need to put on your head about that, right? I have never even owned a gun. I don't even know what a gun looks like. I can't even hold it. What you should worry yourself about? What you should be worried about. I do have something at home. Yeah, I need soup, so. Okay, go. you're here telling me that I can't know one will shoot me. Great brotherhood. Great. Great, Great brotherhood. Great. Great brotherhood. Great. Great. Pass the message. Great Brotherhood. Great. Great Brotherhood. Great. I call for this short meeting to announce to us of our forthcoming examination. Just the way we used to do, to donate the money just for everything to be easy for us. Am I clear? Great. Great. <laughs> Avoiding me. Why are you running away from me? I forbid you to say such. How can you be avoiding someone you claim you love? Just because of that idiot made an empty threat. You call that an empty threat? You so called idiot threatening to take my life. To take my life. Please, I don't want any problem. Then where do you think we are running to? Where I'm going. It's not your business. Don't worry. We'll sort it out. Okay? I love you. 
there is nothing to sort out here. What is this? Is it to be yours? Oh, please, I don't want to lose my Stop following me! Stop following me! Don't worry, we can sort this out. I don't, I don't want any problem from you, from that guy. Please, stop following me. Stop me. following me! Please, stop! Please. Are you okay? I'm begging you. I'm begging you. Stop I'm following me. Okay. was a cultist. I confronted him about it always. But he would quarrel me. But then, I used to see him with some boys. Some dangerous, hard-looking guys, right? I always see them too. I don't know what again, um, from practicing courts. One of them was even this time. The vow to kill my guy doesn't keep a distance from me. You know, I had a dream where he shot someone and was jailed. But I didn't know it was about his death I dreamt of. You see. He does not want what he is. He chose the path he thought was good for him. Please. I am yet to understand what the gain in practicing cultism. Just just look at how Frank wasted all his parents' efforts. Yes, the bread of this city is sweet in the mouth. But at the end, what fuels the mouth is gravel. He did everything possible to lure me to join them, but I refused. Nice you turned down his request. You see, cultism is more dangerous than cancer. <sighs> anyway, my friend will be visiting tomorrow. Which of your friends? Destiny. Oh, your girl. <laughs> Oh boy, that girl has eaten you so deep. Mm. Exactly. That means you have to buy something and keep for yeah, I, 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 I will. I will prepare something. I will cook. Good. Good. Ken! Guess who we have here? <laughs> yeah. What is it? You you don't like her? Excuse me. What's the drama for? Is anything wrong? Ubina, everything is wrong. That girl in there is the girl I told you about. The girl I met a month and two weeks ago. She's the girl I want to settle down with. Kai, I don't understand you. What are you saying? You have to understand me. Please, just leave her for me. She, she's my girl. How would I know she is your girl? You never brought her here to show me. But it doesn't matter. Listen, I want to make her the mother of my children. 
Can you just take your mind off her? Leave her. Ken. Don't you think you're asking for too much? But I mean, you know what? I have something to tell you. Ken. What you're asking me to do is to run on a sharp pointed tongues, barefooted. It's not possible. It is very possible. You can tell her to focus her mind on me since I met her first. Okay. Let's see who she bit for. That's it. What are you talking about? No, what do you want me to do? Huh? You'd never express your feelings to me until Obina came. So, it's your fault, not mine. I'm sorry I wasn't blunt. Yes, I made a mistake. That I, I wasn't able to open up to tell you how I feel about you. I still have some feelings. So, this is your so-called feelings. Of what use is it to me? I want us to get that, please. No, 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 we cannot. I want you to get it straight into your thick skull. This is on you. It's all your fault, okay? So please, don't, excuse don't me. Do don't this, please. go of me. Don't touch me. My heart belongs to Obina now, so deal with it. You home? I, I was looking for you everywhere in school and I didn't see you. I even called your number and it didn't pull through. Why are you not responding to me? Must I respond to everything you say? Why would you even look for me in school? Why are you sounding so angry? I can't remember having quarrels with you before we left for school this morning. Obina, please, can you allow me to concentrate? I'm doing something important here.
have made it crystal clear to you that this cannot work. It's all your fault. Yes, because you were adamant enough not to tell me how you feel about me until Obina, your friend, came. Now, you want me to leave Obina, abandon the sweet relationship that we have going on, and date you. How would I do that? Do you think I don't have conscience? If I do that to you, how will you feel? Please, Ken. It's not possible. And let this be the last time we talk about this. Obina and I, we have something sweet going on. We are enough. And my heart is fixed to where it is. Please. Destiny saw so you raise your voice. That's me. Have you forgotten how I saved your life? Is it a crime to love you? Ken, I am sorry if I have spoken to you in an unfriendly manner. You saved my life and I am so grateful. You don't know how much I appreciate what you did for me. But try to understand. I am already in love with Obina and there is nothing I can do about it. Please. Okay? Please. Okay, you're welcome. Oh, hold on. Um, there is food in the kitchen, so... <clears throat> I'm, I'm, I'm not hungry, okay? Why? I said I'm not hungry. Huh? Uh, why the too, too, too many questions? Ken, I don't know what I've done to you lately that you are so angry with me. Obina, do you want to hear something else from my mouth? Listen, I don't have time for... Much argument, okay? I am just concerned about you, bro. Can you imagine? After I told Obina that I met that girl first, he went ahead with me. Yes! That it should put the girl into our hostel. Thank you. 
Oh, Obina, I never knew you were this evil. So you had a mind to take my girl in front of the light? Ken, you are the evil one here. You are the one! Now let me correct your wrong impression. Destiny is not your woman! Did you ever tell her you wanted to date her? Did you? Didn't I tell you? I met her first. Now, you have to quit. Let me tell you. If Destiny had wanted to date you, from the first time she met you, she wouldn't have taken her eyes off you. Now, what do you mean by that? She doesn't love you. Get it? She doesn't love you. So stop breathing unnecessary quarrel. You're a fool. You are a big fool. I regret knowing you. Ken. Watch your tongue. Have you forgotten so soon? I don't want to ever have anything to do with you. We're done. Mind whatever you have to say. Mind whatever you have to say! Okay, if destiny will bring separation between us, you can go and take her. I hope that makes you happy. Kenneth and Obinda will soon graduate. My prayer is that they get a job as soon as possible. I don't know what this our country is turning into. Many graduates roaming the streets looking for jobs. Yeah. Eh? It will never be their portion in Jesus' name. Amen, oh. Amen. Aha, uh -huh. that reminds me. How about your jam examination? When is it coming up? Next month. Next month. I hope you're studying hard. So you pass this examination. You need the best of education in your life. <laughs> oh, Mama. I appreciate your effort towards my brother and I since our parents died. May God reward you. Amen. Hmm? Enough of your thanking me. You and your brother are my priority. I am human. I am only doing the little I can to make sure you and your brother achieve your dreams in life. Hmm? I can't stop thanking you for all you have done for us. We have relatives. Yet you took us as your own. Mama, God will bless you. I was thinking, um, maybe my son can even marry you. But from the look of things, it's like someone is already in the picture. But my hopes are high. Mm, you never can tell what God can do. Mm? To <laughs> Let me help you. Help, take. some talks yesterday, but it wasn't a healthy talk. He was saying so many things. 
and said I should also stay away from him. It's you. He said I should stay away from him. What's wrong with him? Why is he being so childish? I don't understand. We are going to do this. Well, I told him to go ahead and take you away from him. You what? Why would you do that? Wait, oh, okay, okay. I get the gist. You don't love me. You don't care about me. You don't want to have anything to do with me. Yeah. Are you done playing with me? I mean, this relationship means nothing to you. Really. Please, I'm sorry. You know I love you so much more. No, you don't. Okay. I will not say anything like that again. Point that Obina and Ken quarrels because of you. This is serious. Mirabel, honestly, I am so sick and tired of this whole scenario. I don't understand what Ken's problem is. I already told him that I am not interested in him, yet he kept on pestering me. I mean, he never asked me out before Obina came. So I don't know what his stress is. Obina should be very careful with him. My dear, you're wise. Because this was the same thing I told Obina. Because the way Ken is acting these days is beginning to scare me. And to be honest with you, I'm beginning to dislike him for this. <sighs> oh, babe, you hot though. Hey now, for two friends to suddenly become enemies all because of a woman. And that woman is my friend. Uh, is there something you're not telling me? Well, you said it all. I'm hot. <laughs> mm. My son, you're really the son of a woman. And you have eyes for good things. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you for appreciating her. Welcome, my daughter. Thank you, ma. <laughs> my son had told me a lot about you. <laughs> Seeing you, I think I recognize you. Thank you for accepting me. <clears throat> and the meal is so delicious, I enjoyed it. I heard you from this community. Yes. Wow. We still have such beautiful girls around. Mommy, please stop flattering me. I, am only, I am only saying the truth. Hmm? <sighs> Obina, how is Ken? I hope he's doing good. Hey, Mama, Ken is fine. Ken is fine. He's doing good. Um, okay. Mm. Uh, peace. Uh, did you enjoy the meal? Yes, Mommy. Are I you did. sure? Yes, it's so delicious. Thank you, Mom. Thank you, Mom. Mama, 
I told you she is the right material. <laughs> the jewel that I held into my hands has been taken away by whom I called a friend and brother. Every day I keep seeing this thing in my dream. For two days now, I've not seen that idiot that calls himself Obina. Who knows where he has gone to? God. didn't pick up. So Ken is gone for real. Why? Don't trust nobody. The world's mysterious, full of envy. To know when they will stab you on the back. To know when they will stab you on the back. When must I pick a call? Huh? Will you force me to pick a call? Or are you going to force me to stay under the same roof with you? Ibina, I told you it's over. We're not friends any longer. So it's because of a woman you're acting this way. Ken, this is so childish. Come on, you are the one behaving like a child. You stabbed me from behind. I told you I met Destiny first. Then you convinced her to date you. Go ahead, date her. Okay, you are making some words here. Yes, you told me about a girl quite alright. But you never brought her to show me. So why are you now accusing me falsely as if I knew you were dating Destiny before I I I I I went ahead of you? I mean, please I I want I want to go somewhere, okay? I think I'm not, I'm not done talking about this. And this is how you want to pay me back for all the assistance I've given to you all these years? Yeah, I, I will not dispute that you assisted me. But I promise you, as soon as I graduate, 
You get a good job then, then you back. Even your mama will have to. Really? Okay. Oh, no, I can't go so me. I mean, I, I, I went to see mom and she asked her for you. Do you know I never told her all these things she was saying here? You think I'm bothered even if you had told her? It's none of my business. I can't tell you anymore.
monitor that recorded both of you. Yes, they did. Please, I don't want any problem. And they promise to do more if they see us together again. Please, please. What are you still doing here? Leave! Leave! Please, please, please. Leave! I love you. Nice. Let me go to the canteen and eat. I'll see you later. You shamelessly beat up my boyfriend. Why are you forcing yourself? Into someone who doesn't need you. I don't love you. Judith, what was that for? Have you lost your sense? I should be asking you that. You idiot. <laughs> you slap me again. And I will do that again, again, if you don't know how to humble yourself. And I promise you, you will regret it. You will. I'm waiting. You're walking out on me. Leave me alone. Just Leave me, leave me alone! Leave me alone! You smelling dust. By the spices, baby. You have body odor. <laughs> That's body odor gang, baby. Such a fool. Yes. But let me assure you, if I don't have you, no one else, not all these chewing going boys in the streets. In this campus, it's only me that's gonna have you, baby. Body odor gang. There are many waves out there, right? Listen, you need to forget this thing before the end. It is very clear that the girl in question doesn't even want you. Why? Why didn't we go be in my cover? Please let me tell you. Even the babe, both of you are fighting for me. But someday, don't both of you. For the record, Women don't have conscience at all. You're right, bro. Guys, I swear to God, no woman on earth will feel separate me and Victor. Who born her? Okay, I really do appreciate this meeting. You finding it as important as anything to call the both of us together. All we needed was to be mature about the whole thing, but he decided to blow it up. Imagine I traveled and came back and made the house open. And none of his things were in the house. Is it good? Didn't I tell you I approached her first? Why didn't you leave her for me? Will it kill you? What are you saying? Would it have made sense if, 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 if I start avoiding her because you approached her first? Hello, 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 calm down. Obina, sit down. Sit down, Obina, sit down. What's this? Listen, all I want is both of you to reconcile and be brothers again. What is this now? Calm down. It's all right. Um, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Are you for real? Yes. <laughs> How's this feeling? How's this feeling? How's this feeling? Fine. Hello. Hello.
my brother. Will you kill your brother? Can you please? Yeah? We can sort this thing out. Yes. Yeah, we can sort it out. You're my brother, okay? That's why I'm here. Thank you. Huh? My son, my son, 
whosoever that did this will never go unpunished. My God will judge, my God will punish. This was whosoever that did this. He will be punished severely for this cruel act. you sleep at night knowing that you're evil knowing that you're a murderer ken you shot your own brother and a friend I'm wait I, I shot my own brother ken i don't understand what, what do you mean by that you're asking me so all this while you've been pretending ken let me put it to you that you are a courtist. Come on, why is it anything like this? What has come over you? Huh? Wait, you had a dream last night, isn't it? Ken, you see this hypocritical attitude? It doesn't suit you. <laughs> I know everything. Lucy told me because she saw you, she witnessed the whole drama. She witnessed the whole incident. Wait, Lucy? told you I killed my own brother and you believed her. Why wouldn't I? Why wouldn't I believe her? You have to stop this whole thing, please. Just stop it. Okay, hold on. Are you trying to tell me that Lucy is lying? Yes, of course. What? I'm not a courtist. You know how good and how nice I am. Really? Okay. Come here. Where is Obina? Congratulations. Because last night, the doctor confirmed him dead. What? You've won. You've won. My Obina. You're happy now. Aren't you? Don't yes! Don't Obina is dead. Don't, 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 don't. Thank you. You know, I, 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 come, 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 let me, let me just explain something. Silent killer, silent killer, don't trust nobody. What? What? What were you saying? That... <laughs> I, I don't get it. Mommy, I am not lying to you. I have no reason to lie to you. I cannot sit down here looking at you both in your eyes and I will tell you lies. I don't have any reason to do that. God knows that whatever I am telling you here is the truth, nothing but the truth. 
something is wrong somewhere. God knows. I'm telling the truth. <laughs> Destiny, stop. Mom, I do have a witness. Someone else can attest to what I'm telling you. I mean, the person that witnessed this whole incident, I'm telling you guys now. She saw everything. And she told me. So help me God that everything I'm saying here is the truth and nothing but the truth. Oh, no. You're not sure of what you're saying. There is a mistake somewhere. This can't be true. Destiny, Destiny, look at me in the face. Look at me. Tell me this is not true. You said you needed something. What was that? Uh, I said I need to use this textbook and then it's true. Okay. And Ken, you talked about fine. Okay. I'll give you the money tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Oh, Brina. Okay. Would you need something? Ken, I need something. What about you? I don't need anything. Are you sure? Yeah. <laughs> Please, so you people should be serious with your studies. Mm -hmm. You are folding your hand. You see what Uju is doing. Uju, you have to believe me. I am not telling you lies. I know how difficult it is for you to believe this. I know Ken is your brother and you love him. And I do love him too. But he's not as innocent as you think he is. I don't believe you. I don't. 
My brother can't hurt a fly, let alone human. I don't. How? How? Ken is your brother. And I know you love him. And that's why you're vouching for him. Ken is also my friend. I cannot be lying against him. Please, you have to believe me. Oh, no. No. Stop. Please. Would you let me ask you something? What reason do I have to lie against Ken? Please tell me. Tell me what my reasons are. Tell me why I have to come down here only to tell you lies. No, don't tell me that. No, please. No, don't tell me this. I don't believe you. I don't. Think about it. Would you? Would you? Please think about it.
all the court members have been arrested and detained in our custody. We just brought him here to show some respect. What I have done for you? Taking up your responsibilities. And all I get is this. Let God be the judge. You shot my son. My only son will be left. I'll be nice like a brother to you. You sh shot him. I feel like killing you myself. You are a monster. surprised how I got away with this. My father said that death is unseen. So do not expect it when it's not time to die. You remember this? You gave this to me during my last birthday. This saved my life. This protected the bullet you shot at me from piercing through my heart. Luckily, you got me on the second shot. Miraculously, I survived it. It is said, do the good you can to people. Do not expect same in the time. Thank you, Ken. You were right when you said the bread of the city is sweet in the back. By the end, the mouth is filled with gravel. I'm sorry. Grievances drives emotion into the dark room. Where thoughts takes the negative. <laughs> Take good care of yourself. No, 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 no. Always remember that your brother loves no, you. No, 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 Life is so hard. The heart of man is deceitful. Who can understand? Silent killer, silent killer. Don't trust nobody. The world's mysterious, full of envy. To know when they will stab you on the back. To know when they
trust nobody. The world's mysterious, full of envy. To know when they will stab you on the back. To know when they will stab you on the back. Silent killer. Friends cannot be trusted. Life is so hard. The heart of man is deceitful. Who can understand? Silent killer, silent killer. Don't trust nobody. The world's mysterious, full of envy. To know when they will stab you on the back. It's mysterious. Life is so hard. The heart of man is deceitful. Who can understand? Silent killer, silent killer. Don't trust nobody. The world's mysterious, full of envy. To know when they will stab you on the back. To know when they. Stab you on the back, silent killer. Silent killer, silent killer. Don't trust nobody. Walls is Life is so hard. The heart of man is deceitful. Who can understand? Silent killer, silent killer. Don't trust nobody. The world's mysterious, full of envy. To know when they will stab you on the back. 
To know when they will stab you on the back Silent killer